M0FXB just doing the firmware update for the 705. So here we are, I'll put a, a link to the download in the description. So here we are on the download. So we've selected this and we've clicked download and we get a, a, um, a zip file here we've, which we've extracted to uh, this file here. And what it looks like is just this, 705E12020.dat. Then we right click that and we've sent it to um, our SD card, which is now in the radio. So just uh, carefully put the SD card in the radio and turn it on, push menu, go to set. I'll just make that a bit larger so you can see it even cl clearer. There you go, get it right in the middle. So there we are, we're on SD card and we're going to hit no. SD card, then we're going to hit firmware, we're going to go down and it's going to say do you agree, we're going to click yes, then it wants to make a backup of my memories which definitely yes, I have a lot of memories on this. So let's do that. Um, there, there's some of the things. If you have a look here, there's a few of the things that have hap of, that have been improved with the uh, firmware update. So there it is. There, it's showing in the radio. We'll select it. Uh, firmware updating takes two minutes after updating the 705 will automatically restart until the frequency screen is displayed never turn off the 705 or remove the SD card do you want to update click yes I think you have to hold your finger on the S and then just let it update <coughs> uh, there you go updating the main CPU firmware There's a little countdown there. Updating firmware, waiting again. Got Nico in the background. Being very cute as usual. Firmware updating up date complete so let's let it reboot so we'll probably have to reload our memory so we're updated to 1.20 saw that come up on the screen so now what we'll do is we'll go back to the SD card we we'll go menu set we we'll go back to the SD card if we can find it there it is there, like that, and then we'll load settings. That's all my memories there. We'll click all. Uh, I'll just put no for that. I'll just put yes. Hopefully I've saved that correct. But basically the firmware update is done. We'll have a quick look and see if we can see anything obvious in the menu. May as well. So completed, restart, so let's restart it. Do we can just tap the screen? No, we have to restart it. So turn it off, turn it back on. Oh, it's still got my picture when it boots up. <clears throat> so that's it, all my memory channels are there. And I will just have a quick look at the menu. Uh, menu here. And then look, you've got the preset FTA. I don't even know what that is yet because I haven't experimented yet. I think it's so you don't have to put all the settings in when you, when you do FTA. So I hope that helps. Uh, thanks for watching. And um, I think we'll do the 7300 next. Uh, M0FXB73. Cheers.